Hey YouTube, what's going on? Um, thought I'd make a, a video. Um, I'd like to talk about one of my favorite um, slasher films. Um, period. Uh, this movie is one of my favorites just because it's so... I don't know, I really like just... I like the corniness of it and I like the... Um, I don't know, the kills are cool, and I don't know, I think the killer is really cool too, for some reason. But, uh, uh, this movie is Slaughter High, and it was released in 1986, kind of part of the, I guess, third wave, maybe? Um, kind of the last wave of slasher flicks, before they got, like, rejuvenated in the 90s. Um, but, this movie is basically about this kid, um, Marty, who gets severely burned in a school prank, and he's like, because he's like the school nerd, and, um, is like real sciencey, and gets, he, anyway, he gets hurt with a science experiment that is, that goes wrong from a prank, and, um, ends up in the hospital and all this, and then anyway, so, like, ten years later, or whatever, they have a school reunion. Um, all the kids that prank Marty have a school reunion at their school. And they have no idea why, like, they're there. It's all, like, a, why why they were um, invited. It was a mystery. So, um, yeah, sorry if I'm, like, just kind of rambling. I'm really tired, and um, I'm bad at describing movies. <laughs> I guess I'm not the best person to make movie reviews, but whatever. So anyway, uh, it's got some cool death scenes, like, there's, honestly, I haven't seen this movie in a while, but I know there's some cool ones, like there's an acid bath scene, and um, a scene involving a bed that I think involves, oh, like, a, like an electrifying bed, or, I don't know, just some kind of unconventional slasher death and um yeah but it's a really neat movie it's uh, it wasn't on DVD for a long time and Lionsgate finally released it uncut on DVD as part of the lost collection of just like old B movies and um yeah I used to have this on a VHS tape that I bought from a flea market, and it was the uncut version, luckily, but the video quality was really bad, and it just had a lot of, um, it was just like, it was an old, it was a previous rental, so it was like really, really old, and, um, you know, just used, and everything, so I finally picked up the DVD of it, and I was really happy to get it, and, um, yeah, so if you like slasher movies, um, check this one out. Um, I really can't recommend it enough. I love it. It's so bad it's good, but it's just, it's great in my opinion. It's just, I don't know. The music is really cool too. It actually, um, borrows a lot of music from Friday the 13th and, um, has an interesting little theme song to it too. But, um, um, what was I going to say? I completely forgot what I was going to say, <laughs> but, um, oh, um, and it has, uh, Caroline Monroe from Maniac and from the last horror film, so she plays another kind of victim, obviously, I mean, what else would she play, but, um, yeah, cool movie, really, really, um, just really fun. It's a great movie to like kick back with your friends and watch. Uh, it's also kind of notorious for having extremely old actors like play young parts. Like, I mean, all slashers are pretty, you know, well known for that. You know, having way older, way too old actors playing young teenagers. But this one kind of takes that to a new level. It's just like, it's you know, they're it's just ridiculous. But it's great. That just adds to the cheesiness factor. And, um, yeah, so definitely, if you can check it out, check it out.
Um, make sure you get the DVD so you get the uncut version because you wouldn't want to take a chance with a VHS or it might be a crappy copy of it like mine was. But um, yeah, check it out. Slaughter High, great later entry in the Slasher series in my opinion. I love it. Can't go wrong. So yeah, um, thanks for watching and leave a comment or rate or subscribe and uh, have a great day.